What is going on guys? My name is Pakazak and today I'm going to be showing you how to do this neat little white noise riser. And uh, it sounds like this. Or you can have the have it end like this. Whatever you want, but um, it's really simple, and it's just kind of a cool way to do a white noise rather rather than a uh, white noise riser rather than um, just having you know a filter rise up. It has some interesting MIDI to it, and all it is is just like a bunch of these little notes, um, but and then it goes to this one, which is just this kind of happens when the drop happens or chorus, whatever you want to call it, where that impact happens, and then the just it's a long MIDI note for the noise to just linger on throughout the chorus. And uh, but this part is basically like the build up right here. And so it has these notes, but it also has a delay on it. And it's I was I was working on a track and I kind of wanted to do something interesting. So I was like, OK, let me try putting a, a delay on the <laughs> white noise. And then I changed all the notes to being these like, you know, staccato type notes. And uh, then I put a delay on it. It's a it's a tempo based delay at um, two. So basically, you hear it. Here, let me just play a note. Actually, hold on, so you can hear it better. So it happens like that, and uh, then I also so I got um, the automation clips. Is I do have the uh frequency the band pass rising up and then down and then also the band width rising or getting wider and then narrower and as you can see that here it starts off very narrow and you want it to be kind of narrow i mean you don't you don't have to have it this narrow but uh i kind of like it because you really hear like rather than a bunch of noise happening it's just like you hear the the actual tone like a, and you hear an actual tone more rather than just noise, and you hear that you know frequency or that um tone being pitch pitched up very slowly and uh um rather than just like having it if it was like wider, you can really hear that tone pitchness rise, so like you know if you had it like this or something. You hear it getting higher in frequency, but you don't necessarily hear that tone. That creates that sort of rising effect. And uh, I kind of like that. So, and then I also put just some reverb on it for some extra atmospheric effect. And uh, that's basically it. So, got a very narrow rising, and then it gets slowly and slowly wider bandwidth as it gets higher. And then it just comes back down and gets narrower, narrower again. Yeah, it's kind of a neat little trick with that MIDI to have that delay happen in between the notes. So I just wanted to share that with you. Um, let me know if you have any questions about this. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.